God is love. God showed how much He loved us by sending His only Son into the world so that we might have eternal life through Him. This is real love. It is not that we loved God, but that He loved us and sent His Son as a sacrifice to take away our sins. How great is the love the Father has lavished on us, that we should be called children of God. And that is what we are. If we love each other, God lives in us, and His love has been brought to full expression through us. Love is patient and kind. Love is not jealous or boastful or proud or rude. Love does not demand its own way. Love is not irritable, and it keeps no record of when it has been wrong. It is never glad about injustice, but rejoices whenever the truth wins out. Love never gives up, never loses faith, is always hopeful, and endures through every circumstance. Love will last forever. How precious is your unfailing love, O God. All humanity finds shelter in the shadow of your wings. Can anything ever separate us from Christ's love? Does it mean He no longer loves us if we have trouble or calamity or are persecuted or are hungry or cold or in danger or threatened with death? No. Despite all these things, overwhelming victory is ours through Christ who loved us. And I'm convinced that nothing can ever separate us from His love. Death can't, life can't, the angels can't, the demons can't. Our fears for today, our worries about tomorrow, and even the powers of hell cannot keep God's love away. Whether we're high above the sky or in the deepest ocean, Nothing in all creation will ever be able to separate us from the love of God that is revealed in Christ Jesus our Lord. May your roots go down deep into the soil of God's marvelous love. And may you have the power to understand, as all God's people should, how wide, how long, how high, and how deep His love really is. May you experience the love of Christ, though it is so great, you will never fully understand it. Then, you will be filled with the fullness of life and power that comes from God. Because God is love, He is unconditionally committed to my well-being. 